Hi there. My name's Gary, Gary Dawson, and I'm the uh, the person behind DawsonCreative.ca. Uh, my name is Gary Dawson, and I will be your instructor. I'm here today to uh, uh, present a new course that I'm putting on, to give you a little intro into a new course that I'm putting on, on some exciting new software. Uh, we'll be training on something called Serif Movie Plus Starter Edition. It's a very powerful and remarkably free video editing software package. Um, I say again, absolutely free. And uh, I've been looking around for a very long time for a good free video editing package uh, for my customers, for my students, and I believe I've found one. And this training course, uh, you will be able to download and install the free software on your computer. And you will learn how to edit videos using this software. Uh, of course, you would pay for my course. Uh, the course will be uh, a paid course. And, uh, but at the end of it, you will be able to use this free software and edit your videos that you can take with your camcorder to use them, upload them to YouTube, or produce them into a DVD, or do anything you want with them. Uh, it will be a uh, very extensive course. and. Uh, Let's just quickly take a look at the website. All right, uh, to get to the Serif uh, Movie uh, Plus website for download, you type serif.com slash movie plus. You'll be taken to the web page with the full version of Movie Plus. That's version X6. Uh, we don't want to download that version. To reach the free version, you go to free downloads and click on free Movie Plus. Click on that link, and you can go to the Movie Plus Starter Edition. As it says here, it's 100% free. It is not ad-supported. Ad it is not a software that is just a free trial that will suddenly expire. It is, however, feature limited. It contains all the features required to produce a movie better than Windows Movie Maker, but some of the transitions and other advanced features they have removed. Uh, but for our course, uh, you will be able to use this software to produce a first-class, state-of-the-art video that is far superior to anything that you will produce in Windows Movie Maker. Click on Download Free Now to download it and install it on your computer. Okay, so once you have downloaded and installed the software, you'll probably start it up and look at it and wonder what all those controls are. I produced a little introduction to the interface of these three software, which we'll have a look at now, and you'll get a quick introduction as to how the software works and what we'll be covering in the course. Let's have a look at that now. Here we have the start screen for Serif Movie Plus Starter Edition. This splash screen will appear if you want to have it eventually start where the splash screen does not appear, you can click the Don't Show This Wizard Again here and close it. It will not appear again. Um, we have several options available depending on what you want to do. Start a new project, import from disk, copy from a device, capture from a device. This is very good software because it allows you to capture from your webcam directly into the program. Of course, a list of uh, previously open programs is available or you can browse your computer using the browse button here to find a video and open it from here. Also the learning window has a whole series of advanced videos which are available. We won't be uh, covering these. Uh, these are for the full version users. Um, if you could want to browse them, go right ahead. However, we will be covering the software in much more depth than these during our course. Click on the X to close the window, and let's take a quick look at the interface. You see it's a very advanced interface. It has over here the file menu and a ribbon of standard buttons. Very simple as well, too. Over here we have a media gallery. We have galleries of transition, video effects, audio effects, and titles, and also properties for individual videos. Down here we have the timeline, overlay track, video track, audio track, and music track. Yes, you can put music into this free version. Over here we have how to. You can close this if you want to by clicking on the X. I just leave it going. 
Let's take a quick look at the file menu. You see it is a very comprehensive software and all of these commands may seem very intimidating to you now but once we've taken the course they will be very easy to understand. It's important you understand that certain features are disabled in this software. The items that are marked with a pink highlight are not available. Here under Tools, RIP CD, Record Narration, Write File to DV, HDV Camcorder, Write Disk from Image, and Write Blu-ray Disk from Image is not available. It is available for those who want to upgrade to the paid version. Also, Show Levels Meter is not available. And over here on Insert, Video Groups, Audio Bus, and Apply Envelope is also not available. Menu Designer is also not available, but everything else is available. Over here on the right side of your screen, we have the Project Browser to import media. Simply click on Import Media. You can import from your computer, copy from a device, or capture. RIP CD is available for those who upgrade to the more advanced version. Library allows you to browse through your computer and there are items available on here which we will be covering during the course. Fortunately, Quick Shapes is not available and that's why it is highlighted under uh, with the uh, orange highlight is because in the free version Quick Shapes is not available. On the free version that will become available. Under Explorer, you can browse your computer. As you can see here, you can browse your computer and find whatever items you want to import into the project. Also on this side of the screen, you'll see under Galleries, you'll see Transitions, Audio Effects or Video Effects, and Titles, and called Envelopes, which is also only available for those who upgrade to the next highest version. Under transitions you'll see a wide array of transitions are available. However be aware that the items marked with the eyedrop, which are very advanced, these are not available in the free version. If you use these a watermark will appear on your video advertising the software. We'll We'll do that during the course just to show you what they look like. I, however, use the basic version transitions, which are all free and permanently free. Clock wipe, crossfade, which is right here, and iris wipes, and linear wipes. You'll notice all of these are free. However, some of the more advanced ones, such as random blocks, slides, spirals, spiral blocks, squeeze, unfold down, zigzag, zoom and spin. They look very good and we will preview them in our course but we won't use them unless of course you want to use them with the watermark. Video effects, you'll notice that most of these, in fact almost all of them, are available in the free version except some such as Victorian more red, more blue, but green screen, blue screen, rose tinted, most of the effects are available. As you scroll down you'll see a lot more which are available to those who upgrade. Diffuse, Glow, Emboss, Filter, Gamma, Gaussian Blur, Gradient Map, Grayscale, Invert, Levels, Mask, Mosaic, Motion Blur, Noise. Ones that are available is Grayscale, that makes your movie look like it's an old movie, and Levels which will adjust, as you can see, your color levels. Everything else is available only once you upgrade. Audio effects are available as well. We will go over these briefly in the course, but not into great depth during the course. You see pretty much all of them are available. In fact, I haven't found one yet that is not available in the free version. Titles, you'll also notice they are pretty much mostly available without any restriction in the free version. However, you'll notice a lot of animations here and these are 
not available in the version that is free, except you will see pop up. It is free and forever free. Zoom and fade, it is also forever free. Now we will be previewing these animations and actually learning how to use the free ones in the course. Let's go down to the timeline now. You'll see we have a toggle between timeline mode and storyboard mode. Storyboard mode allows you just to drop a clip, whatever clips you want, arrange them and add transitions between them. You'll see we have an overlay track for your, your video uh, introduction screens, a video track, an audio track, and a music track. And yes, you can put music into the free version. All of these controls, how to cut and how to create effects, we will cover that during the course of the training. Uh, you'll also notice that record narration is not available. If you click on it, you will be required to buy the upgrade version. So that's a basic outline of what we'll be covering in the course. And I think if you produce videos for YouTube, you will find this software far superior to anything that you can do with Windows Movie Maker. All right, what we're going to do now is we'll just review what you're going to learn in the course um, so that you will have a better idea of exactly what to expect when you're taking this training program. The course is called Using Serif Movie Plus Starter Edition Freeware. There are three lessons of two hours each. This training is delivered live, online, in a virtual classroom. Enrollment is limited to 10 spaces for students. So uh, be aware that when, uh, when the class is full uh, and everything is gone, it's gone. You'll have to wait till the next class comes around if you would like to join. In the class, you will learn how to capture live onto your computer from your webcam or from a DVD or from a camcorder into the program. From there, you will learn how to drag and drop videos and other media from the library onto the timeline to trim, arrange, edit, and add transitions. You will also learn how to create and import basic titles and transitions and pop-ups and zooms and fades. You will also learn the commands on the file menu thoroughly. You will know every single command and on the button toolbar. You will learn how to use the timeline and the storyboard to edit and arrange clips, add transitions, titles, effects and animations. You will learn how to output the video production in the best quality that you can get to upload to YouTube or to save the DVD or on any other media format. Finally, I'd like to say once again this is done in a virtual classroom live via the internet. You will get to watch videos, ask questions, and view live software demonstrations. Uh, there is nothing like live online training. I will be able to interact with you, answer your questions, and of course, once the course is done, if you are using the software, you will be able to turn to me for technical support. I don't know what you want to use this software for, whether it's professional use or whether it's personal use, but whatever use it, it is for, once we're done, I will be available for technical support afterwards. To sign up, visit www.dawsoncreative.ca slash serifmovieplus. There will be a page there that will allow you to sign up and you will be able to learn more about the course on that page. Thank you very much for watching this presentation. I hope you will join our course. It's very exciting, and we hope that you will visit us again and uh, learn more about the exciting online training that I am making available around the world, throughout Canada, the USA, and around the world through DawsonCreative.ca. Thank you very much. Have a nice day. Bye for now.